All right, guys and gals, Crypto Kurt here with another follow-up video on the Spectre dividend token potential payouts. Uh, I, by mistake, I ended the previous video um, early, so this is a follow-up to that video. In the previous video, we looked at the balanced um, expectations that came from Spectre. In this video, we're going to be looking at the bullish expectations uh, that were given by Spectre, but I need to give the disclaimer again because someone may find this video before they see the other video and they won't understand the disclaimers that I need to put in place. So first off, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. This should be construed for educational and entertainment purposes only. Secondly, there's a whole series of financial variables which are going to be used in these calculations which can change dramatically. So there is no way, second disclaimer, there is no way to actually calculate the actual finite payout that an individual will get in any given month or any given year based on all of the variables. And we'll have a look at those variables right now. So as if you come to Spectre AI, uh, which is their website, uh, which is spelled S-P-E-C-T-R-E dot A-I. You can come down to the forecast and you'll be able to access the Google spreadsheets, uh, Google Docs, uh, which we have here that we're going to have a look at. And as I said, there's a number of assumptions that, uh, that we're making here that Spectre made when they put these numbers together. The first assumption, which immediately is causing me some grief, is they have total dividend tokens issued of 70,135,345. 70, if we come here to uh, CoinMarketCap, they're showing a circulating supply of 79,191,384. Now, I have heard instances of uh, where CoinMarketCap has these numbers wrong. Again, we don't really know, so I basically did a mathematical variable to divide out the you know 70 divided by 79, which gives me a variable which I'm using as my calculator to, to calculate the actual payouts. It, that could be completely wrong. 79 million might be the right number. 70 million might be the right number. But I am using the, this problem and trying to apply a mathematical fix to it. So at least we get some kind of rounding uh, situation to offset the difference of the 9 million token difference. I know it seems ridiculous, um, but it is what it is. And I'm trying to, do, I'm trying to come up with a spreadsheet that's going to be as close as possible. The other variables are a number of different variables. So the first is the number of people trading the first year. So they're assuming 8,000 people are trading on the platform in the first year. They're assuming those people are making 10 trades per day. They're assuming that the trade value is $50 per trade, which generates $500 in volume per day per person. They're assuming a win rate of 51%. They're assuming a ROI of 75%. So just out of those variables alone, take out the circulating figures, right? That's We've already fixed that or we've applied a solution to that. They could have 6,000 traders doing 25 trades a day valued at $75 a day with a 49% payout, right? So once again, all we can do is take this snapshot of these numbers that they've applied in this, in this scenario and apply that to a spreadsheet that's going to let us calculate our potential earnings based on the number of tokens that we have. So this spreadsheet is a great spreadsheet. It's been really well put together, but all it does is it gives you the per dividend token, uh, per dividend payout per one token. So what I've done is taken a U U um, Excel spreadsheet and basically built it such that we can plug these numbers in, which are the payout numbers, the top line payout numbers, and uh, apply some calculations based on the number of tokens that we actually have. So again, using the bullish scenario supplied to us by Spectre, using this snapshot, Let's go have a look at what the potential payout could be. Now, again, there's another assumption here. I have five investment amounts, 250, 500, 1,000, 5,000, 10,000. This is based on a value of 52 cents per token, which is what it was when I looked at it five minutes ago. And I'm not going to refresh it because I don't want to have to change the calculation. But the point being is that the minute you watch this video, these this could be wrong straight away because as the price of the shares go up and down, you're going to potentially get more or less of those tokens for your set value, okay? The payout numbers should still be roughly the same, um, but it's just the number of tokens you're actually gonna get from your investment could vary quite a bit as the value of tokens go up and down. So if we look at this and we say 480 tokens based on $250, based on a price point of 52 cents per token, you can see that, again, these are the transaction numbers that are being taken from the Spectre numbers. You can see that the uh, annual payout is 0.056 cents. 
using 480 tokens times 0.56 cents. Uh, and then we divide that by 12, we get a monthly payout of $2.22. We have a one-off annual dividend or annual special dividend, which is paid out once per year. So we add those two together and we get our annual earnings of $93. You can run down through the numbers and you can see over the next 10 years, you are potentially going to generate $38,416. Now, here's another question. The, um, the payouts are going to be made out in ETH, Ethereum. So we have to make some assumptions there. I haven't done this in this calculation. All these are using just direct math. But you have to, well, you don't have to. You should assume that Ethereum is going to go up in value over the next 10 years. Sure, something may come out and be the Ethereum killer three years from now, four years from now. But let's assume for the next couple of years anyway that Ethereum potentially is going to go up in value. So these numbers could actually increase in value as well uh, based on the amount or the value of Ethereum. So if you put the $1,700 in your pocket and then two years later Ethereum is worth double, then obviously you've doubled your money uh, just by holding on to that Ethereum as well. So let's say you're going to put in uh, 500 bucks and you get the 961 tokens. You can see that, again, the numbers change um, as per the payout uh, values. And you can see that putting in $500 will potentially pay you out $76,913 over the next 10 years. If we put in, uh, let's say you're going to spend $1,000 and we're going to get uh, 1,900 tokens, 1923. You can see that putting in $500, sorry, putting in $1,000 could potentially pay you out $153,906 over the next 10 years. Again, guys, that's the present day value of the Ethereum that you're gonna be paid out. Again, pretty exciting. Let's say you wanna take it to the next level. You're gonna put in $5,000. You're gonna get nine, six, one, five of those things. Now we're talking some serious cash. Uh, you put in uh, 5,000, you let it sit for 10 years, and you potentially get a total payout value of $769,000 five hundred and thirty three dollars let's say you're cashed up and you're ready to put, go all in with ten grand and you're gonna put in nineteen two three oh all right we fixed that up uh, and we're look, talking about some serious jack now so nineteen thousand tokens over the next ten years is gonna be generating you one point five million dollars you can see that you know, from 2022 on, you're going to be making over $100,000 in passive income. And this is true passive income. I've mentioned before that passive income doesn't happen passively, but this really does. All you have to do is go make the investment and then hold the tokens on your wallet and just let the dividends come in. Now, the dividends are going to be paid initially out monthly, but I've heard Kay in an interview say that he does want to be paying them out uh, weekly. And then, of course, you're going to get the one-off annual dividend as well. And we're not sure about... Um, when the what month of the year the annual dividend is going to be paid uh, but again you're looking at you know quite a bit of money when you have nine dollars and ninety seven per token times nineteen thousand um, and then you're going to add back in the uh, the payouts uh, on a dividend basis as well so this is some serious money that can be generated on this platform now granted there's no guarantee that the platform is going to stay around but I will add that the Spectre guys have developed their own blockchain and they're inviting other applications to develop applications on their platform. And I know they've signed up with two partners, possibly three. And the one of the requirements for these partnerships is that there's some kind of distribution out to the, uh, the token pool, which is going to be increase the dividends as well. So these numbers, while bullish, are still only based on the Spectre dividend payout numbers has nothing to do with the amount of dividends that could be potentially added to this pool as more and more companies start doing business on that platform and start contributing transaction fees to the dividend distribution pool. So very, very exciting stuff. I don't know anywhere else in the world where you could put in 10,000 and potentially 10 years later have 1.5 million paid out to you. And again, as long as that platform stays around, that's going to just grow and grow and grow over time. So there's lots of ways to speculate about what would happen, you know, is it bought out, blah, 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 blah. But again, using these scenarios, using the forecast, the bullish forecast given by Spectre and the numbers that we see here, this is pretty exciting stuff. So, you know, I love my passive income. It's just an absolute no brainer. I'm in this for the long run and I'm going to be following up on this as Spectre grows. Again, the platform goes live in March. 
and then the first the dividend payout happens in April. So it's going to be really exciting times. I think this is this coin could moonshot once people start actually seeing some payouts. So keep an eye on it. If you're not ready to jump in now, uh, again, this is not financial advice, but you may want to jump in now. All right, guys, hopefully this was helpful, was in, uh, insightful, and give me a like, give me a subscribe, and please share this with any other people who are excited about passive income, because this is the real deal. All right, Crypto Kurt out.